In this lesson, we are going to dive into the basics of folder management in Kali Linux. Take note that most of the comments that you will encounter in this lesson are similar to the ones that we explored in the file management lesson. First, let's create a folder. Creating a folder in Linux is a breeze. All you need to do is use the mkdir command, followed by the desired folder name. For example, if you want to create a folder called Notes, simply type mkdir followed by Notes. And just like that, the folder Notes has been created. Next, let's talk about copying folders. To copy a folder in Linux, you'll use the cp command. In this example, we're going to copy the notes folder we just created to the tmp folder. So we start with cp tag r notes forward slash tmp. Now let's move on to renaming folder. To rename a folder in Kali Linux, you'll use the mv command. Let's rename notes to my notes. We start with mv, followed by the folder name notes, and then the new folder name my notes. Here we go. The mv command is also used to move folders from one directory to another. So let's move the newly renamed folder to the TMP directory. I'm going to clear the screen first. So the comment is MV, my notes, and the destination folder is TMP. As you can see, the my notes folder is not here anymore. Finally, let's see how to delete folders. To delete a folder in Kali Linux, you'll use the rm command. Let's switch to the tmp folder and list its contents. Now to delete the folder notes, we'll use the rm command with the tag r option to specify that we want to delete a directory and its contents. And that's it, folks. As a professional penetration tester, it's essential to be familiar with these comments so that you can manipulate folders on target systems during a penetration test. Now it's your turn to start practicing this lesson. Remember, the more you practice, the better you become.